Hey guys, and welcome to Car Guy 1999 Reviews as well as Quirk Automotive. Today, we have the 2020 Chevrolet Suburban Premier. So this is the top of the line trim, uh, no expenses spared, every option you can get. As you can see, this is a big SUV. This is about as full size as you can get. For example, take a look at the cargo area. It is massive. Even with the third row seats, you have plenty, plenty of room. So the exterior color is known as Summit White. Uh, jet black and mahogany interior. So let's see. So this is the Premier Plus. Uh, 6.2 liter V8, 10 speed, 22 inch chrome wheels, the power retractable steps, uh, a generator, well that's pretty cool, uh, active noise cancellation, transfer case, a two speed transfer case, uh, roof rack, theft deterrent, 12 months of 4G LTE Wi-Fi, really, really, really nice. Uh, so total for everything is 81480 so it's it's up there but for what you get I think this is a pretty good bargain here's your key nice Chevrolet keyless fob we'll take a look at the back seat room there's your steps a ton of room in here You do have power pedals. Not many cars offer that. All right. Foot on brake. Push button to go. is in demonstration mode connected by OnStar's high-speed 4G connection press the blue OnStar button to learn more you can shut that off obviously the dealership put it we put it in demonstration mode but really 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 nice I have no complaints with this everything feels absolutely spectacular let's go ahead let's take it for a drive not sure if you can see it on camera, but we do have a heads-up display. I'm gonna have to put the window down so I can see out the side. always works out in in the way that traffic is you know traffic is huge when I start filming
the active noise cancellation is doing its part. You cannot hear anything in the outside world. And the 6.2 liter V8 up front provides a lot of power. More than enough to haul this family hauler up to speed limit speeds. It does have active cylinder deactivation, so right now we're running in four cylinder mode. And it kicks back into V8 when you need the power. There's no discernible change. I can't hear anything in the exhaust note or anything like that. So well done Chevrolet for that. What's nice is when you're driving, it's just like a Tahoe. So the Tahoe is essentially a shortened version of the Suburban. Or if you want to go where the Suburban's an extended version of the Tahoe, you can say this. they mean the same thing. Um, sitting here facing forward, I don't feel like I have the extra foot behind me. It drives just like a normal SUV, nothing, nothing crazy at all. Um, it's very, very comfortable. The seats are extremely comfortable for long hauls, um, and you won't have anybody complaining about lack of room in the back seats because, well, there's a ton of room back there. That V8 pr provides such an amazing soundtrack. I thought I just heard a plane land, so that's why I was looking in the mirror. do have manual mode if you were to put it into low you can use the rocker switch on the gear column selector itself you also have tow haul mode which will hold gears a little bit longer um, and I believe it locks you out of 10th gear since if you're towing or hauling you don't really need that overdrive
So to summarize, I love it. This is an awesome SUV. Um, if you're asking yourself if it's worth the $81,000, it is. If you just need the extra space, I believe a base Suburban runs you right about $50,000. So if you just want the extra space, you can go ahead and save almost 30000 Well, 30000 yeah. Just by, you know, not buying all the options. However, if you want the most luxurious SUV on the block, full-size SUV on the block, it's a Suburban. Suburban's your, your way to go. So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. Please stay tuned for future content, and have a great day.